So this is, I guess, a bit of an older one, but back at G-Star 2018, Netmarble, known for Lineage 2 Revolution and Seven Nights, amongst other games, revealed that not only Blade & Soul Revolution and Seven Nights 2 were in development, but also A3 still alive. Now, A3 was an older MMORPG that had a very large focus on PvP, open world PvP more specifically. Yet, even though the game was technically announced back in 2018, the game is still very much under development. Netmarble themselves plan on actually opening an esports league for the game towards the end of this year. However, up till this point, no specific date has been given as to when the game is going to officially launch. Now, judging by the fact that they do plan on holding esports events and tournaments though, it would be a safe bet to assume the game will be coming out sometime this year, likely before the league opens. Whether that's the first quarter of 2020 though, or the third quarter is up for discussion, but it is a safe bet to expect it this year nevertheless. Now, as I mentioned, the original game had a very strong emphasis on PvP. With this in mind, Netmarble announced that A3 will actually have a large focus on PvP as well, but more in the form of a battle royale. And yes, I know, I know, the thought of yet another battle royale mode in an MMO is enough to automatically dissuade you from playing, but their attention is still going to be on the MMO side of things. I'm unsure if the BR mode is going to be the only form of PvP, and if so, whether there will be different game modes, however, there is still plenty of PvE content to be had as well. The game is predominantly an MMORPG after all, with the BR aspect being more of a secondary focus. A3 itself is going to play much like any other MMO. Well, I mean, actually, they claim that A3 Still Alive is going to play much like its predecessor, A3, on PC almost two decades ago. There will be various traditional classes, the Holy Trinity actually, more specifically, dungeons, lots of world content, and, uh, well, I mean, that's all that's been revealed thus far. But they assure us that it's going to be every bit as much of an MMO as every other MMO out there. Honestly, though, the game could turn out to be a pretty fun PvP MMO. I've played various mobile MMOs that claim to be heavy PvP MMOs like Alliance X Empire, but they were just, I don't know, kind of forced and seemed uh, empty and kind of void of personality. I know some people love PvP. Well, okay, I, I know a lot of people love PvP. I myself love PvP, but I've never personally played a mobile game with fun PvP, especially not an MMO. So I, I guess this is a little difficult for me to believe. Nevertheless, I hope that the game delivers what Netmarble promise it will, as there's definitely a market for it. But that is just my opinion, my first impressions of the game. What do you guys think? Does it look like something that you'd be interested in? Let me know down in the comments below and let's talk about it. Anyway guys, that is it for me. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe for more content like this and I'll see you all next time. Peace. Someday soon I'm gonna make it.